Recently, HCC's Stafford campus hosted its Welcome Week kickoff, but this semester's event had an added purpose. District 7 trustee Nita Sane explains. We are here to basically welcome all the students, new students and returning students. And we are also here to give very important information that will make sure that they are safe uh, um, when they are drive, driving their vehicles. Uh, and this is an issue that was brought to me, uh, brought to my attention over the holidays and I felt it was time for us to make sure our students are aware of it, our community members know about it and our faculty and staff are also well informed about it because this is a serious and urgent matter for Houstonians. There are hundreds of thousands of cars on the road that have defective airbag inflators and these defective parts can explode uh, during deployment blasting shrapnel into passenger compartment and there have been several injuries and deaths across the nation including two in Houston. One student from Fort Bend was killed last year because of this defective uh, piece in the vehicle uh, and another person was killed, uh, he was from Spring, Texas. And so this is an urgent matter, it needs to be informed uh, to anybody and everybody. We have to make sure our communities are safe, our neighbors are safe and so this is about spreading the word. And I think this is a right moment to educate our students to, you know, as we welcome them to the spring semester and uh, to this campus. So that's why we are here today. If you weren't able to attend the event, Rogene G. Calvert of Airbag Recall Houston Coalition explains how to find out if your vehicle is at risk. There is a website and it's airbagrecall.com and they can go on it and there's a place to put your VIN in. That's a vehicle identification number, a long series of numbers on the driver's side of your dashboard or on your insurance card or on your uh, registration card. Punch that in and it will tell them if their car is on the uh, high risk group or if it's at risk at all. Um, there are a number of cars that may not be high risk and high risk means that it's an old model, 2001 to 2003, Honda or Acura, and others are on the list. They're not as high risk, but they, we still encourage them to take the car in. Now, they can take the car in, it will be replaced, the inflator that's in the airbag, which is the part that is causing death. And the reason is, is hot and humid climate, especially, and what do we have in Houston in the middle of January is hot and humid. We have over a half a million vehicles in the Houston area that are uh, endangered. And so you punch that number in, you find out if your car is on the list, call any dealership of the model of your car, and they are by law required to replace it free of charge. You should not be charged anything. And if you are out of the use of the car for a time, they are to loan you a car for whatever you know time they need to repair yours. And then if they say they don't have the parts in yet, then be sure they have you on a list to notify you when it comes in. And so we ask our audience to reach out to family, friends, people they know, you know, fellow students, and tell them about this because that's the only way that people will listen. We send out notices but you know you get a lot of things in the mail and you may toss it aside and many people we've talked to said oh yeah I remember getting that and I didn't pay it attention. So a personal contact will be important. Just punch in that number that's all it takes is a few minutes and you'll know for sure how you stand. Visit www.airbagrecall.com for more information and resources. For HCC Beat, I'm Stacy Hawkins.